Berlin, mm-hmm. somewhere in Germany, a guy loaded up a wagon, like like your little red wagon. Mm-hmm. Little radio flyer. Yep. Um, with 99 smartphones. Mm-hmm. Launched Google Maps on them all and then carted them down the road and caused – there was no one actually on the road, but as far as Google Maps was concerned, it was a giant traffic jam. Is that really 99 <laughs> cell phones in there? That It looks like it should be more. That's what it's. That's what the article said that I that I had, and I I actually saw this article in three different places, and mm-hmm. both all had the same ninety nine number. Easy. They, so they, um, have a, they have a split screen, and you can see the traffic, like the reported high traffic, moving along <laughs> with them through this. Wow. So this was like this was just a test, I believe, right? Um, and this was something that worked for Google, if I'm not mistaken. I thought he was an artist. Maybe he was an artist. Okay. And, and this is just like a side street bridge. There's literally nobody on this. This guy's like strolling down the middle of the street with his wagon. That's great. And going back to the very first discussion that we had when we started the show with my errant uh, Facebook post, mm-hmm. this was the story that I was forwarding. Oh, this was the hmm? This was the <laughs> hmm. This is the original hmm. Because my thought was, I kind of want to go get a red wagon in 99... 99- and just, I keep wanting to say 99 red. Listen, blue blues, you know what? It, that's if, not the case. And you know what the secret is? You know what the secret is? If you are, if you are somebody that, um, you know, with ways and everything, some people in certain neighborhoods they become cut across neighborhoods. Yeah. Actually, mm-hmm. we are one of these neighborhoods. I think about this. So if you want everybody to, <laughs> if you want to everybody avoid cutting through your to neighborhood. avoid cutting through your neighborhood because they're all using GPS, this trick. <laughs> It's going to be a lot of data planned from AT&T. It's going to be, but I mean, even if you're like, you know, hey, here's five phones all running um, uh, Google Maps right now during rush hour, it's going to say, don't go that way. Right? Yeah. In the long run. It, it's interesting. It would be interesting to see what does it take to get your street to turn red? Mm-hmm. Like, does it take five phones? Mm-hmm. Ten phones? I mean, this guy had a hundred, mm-hmm. but. It, it, it's an interesting idea as well as think about it. If you wanted to control a traffic pattern mm-hmm. or if you want to divert people past your place of business, that's very, it, it, oh. uh, <laughs> now that versus taking out an ad on ways with a little pin on it that lets me know where every sheets is. Uh, I don't know which is more cost effective when you're, paying for this many katie okay. you you katie you've looked at uh geolocation and things like that um could you could you imagine any interesting effects to this <laughs> 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 this just sounds like fun like i just really want to mess with people like you would just be like oh yeah i did i'm tired of so you know this road being blocked off you know traffic in the morning i'm just gonna make it look like part of the west end's closed <laughs> All right. So here's here's what we're gonna do. There's there's a new Boost Mobile down the street. There's a <laughs> hey, what's, what's the other hey, one? Hey, can down? we borrow some phones, guys? We're gonna yeah. get some phones. Can we get a sponsorship? We're gonna, we're, we're gonna get some local kids, and they're just gonna walk up and down Broadway. Yes. <laughs> With red wagons. With red wagons. Yes. This will be like, oh wow, you're moving pretty slow. Is there traffic? Yes, there is. <laughs> how did you How did you get sponsored by Boost Mobile and Radio Flyer? It doesn't seem right for a tech podcast. Uh, like, well, it's a funny story. So no, that's fantastic. No, 